Well, welcome back to the Student Daily Bulletin of finally November 1st, 2019. Yo, yo, what's up with the hair, dude? I dyed it instead of spraying it. Mistake. Anyways, big games tonight. We will host a playoff game Friday at 7 o'clock versus Dearborn Western. Tickets for this game will be $6 and no passes will be accepted. Please make it a point to bring singles to the game so that it is easier to process as many people as yo, possible. Yo. Jet Boskin's supposed to say that, man. What are you saying? I know, he's sick today. Oh. Anyways, attention all clubs. There is a general council meeting today. Moving forward, they will be held during, uh, they will not be held during NHS meetings. Please come to room A106 at 225. All clubs must be present to continue having their concessions. Make sure that a member of your club attends and bring a project of which you would like to support, you have to support. Like if there's a fundraiser going on, bring notice to it at the thing. And it's not too late. The annual Mother Daughter Tea is today from 6 to 7.30 p.m. Once again, this event will take place at the Dearborn Center for Performing Arts. Come and enjoy tea, pastries, and do the hat and hijab contest. Buy raffle tickets to win a variety of fun-filled baskets and enjoy student entertainment. Please see Ms. Shamsuddin in the School Social Work Office or Ms. Herrick in B209 or A116A today for your $12 tickets. More club, any, more club information, Fortune, the Fortune Club of Political Science will be collecting travel size toiletries and hygiene products for the homeless Conju in conjunction with Wayne State University from October 31st to Friday, November 15th. Gifts will be accepted at the tractor and in Mrs. Memminger's room at A104. Time to get in the giving spirit. Welcome the, welcome, uh, the Welcome Club is back. If you are interested in joining the Welcome Club, please join us in, Miss, in Mrs. Al Hashemi's room in F two two hundred and one, or on thir on Thursday, November seventh, two thousand nineteen, at two thirty p.m. All are welcome. All right. Like to argue your opinion? Join the debate club. First meeting Wednesday, November sixth, in room A one hundred six. Our politics in your future? Make a difference at the city level and be in the council. Join the Dearborn Youth Advisor Council. Stop in room A one hundred six to get the link to fill out your application. And from all the animal lovers out there, the Paul's Animal Clubs providing animals with support. Uh, the the Paul's Animals Club helps animals in need. They will be volunteering at the animal shelter, Detroit Dog Hospital, and the dog park, and will be many fundraisers and drives. Uh, the first meeting will be today in B205. Everyone is welcome. And want to play at the uh, Powder Buff? Volleyball game? Buff, yeah. yeah. Uh, come get a team from Miss A, uh, Miss Altamonte, in room A one six A one eight oh six. I'm sorry, guys. In addition to the team form, you will get a raffle ticket to be in the drawing to duke it out in a volleyball competition. Your team must return the form by two thirty today. That's that's like it has to be done. So tickets will be drawn after school to see who plays in the f game in February. Time is running out, so hurry and get your info in. Can you imagine Jed Bloskins over there? Oh man, he would dominate. <laughs> but anyways, know. students, Michigan Health Smiles is coming to Fortson to provide free dental care. That's, that's a great opportunity. So if you are interested or in need of dental work, please see Ms. Z Zaydan for more information. And want, to, want volunteer hours? Interested in decorating around the school? Well, come to room A106 to get ready to change things up. The design meeting is today after school. The next meeting is on Thursday, uh, November 7th. Can't wait to see you there. Are you interested in, in coding? Then there's a course here at Fortson you need to talk to your counselor about. Code.org uh, computer science discoveries curriculum see as discoveries in an introductory computer science course that empowers students to create authentic artifacts and engage with computer science as a medium for creativity communications problem solving and fun this is a great course the course takes a wide lens on computer science by covering topics such as problem solving programming physical computer html slash css and data. The course inspires students as they build their own websites, apps, games, and physical computing devices. That sounds great, guys. All right, attention junior or seniors. There are a couple of college visits next week. The uh, Purdue University, Wednesday, November 6, 2019. University of Michigan, uh, Dearborn, on site. Um, that will be on Thursday, November 7th. All right. Anyways, um, upcoming award and scholarship deadlines. There's are going to be the 2020 Perdue Spirit of Community, 
that's gonna start now through no from November 5th now through November 5th I'm sorry guys students in grades 5 through 12 are invited to apply for the 2020 virtual spirit of community awards if they have volunteered within the past year also the Elks most valuable student scholarship 2020 applications are available at this site and the start date is August 5th 2019 deadline is November 5th 2019 all right so misplaced or ma manage Mangled, I know it's a hard word, messed me up too. Yeah, mangled your ID. You can you can get a new one from the consulting office for the consulting office for only five dollars. And finally, for uh, for the year final for the yearbooks. Yearbooks are now on sale for seventy-five dollars. On November 29th, yearbooks will go up in cost to eighty dollars starting from November 30th. From January 31st. Uh, after junior 31st, cost will increase to $85 and you will no longer be able to personalize your, your yearbook. Get yours now while the cost is lower and supplies last. Yeah. And well, another thing that I wanted to say is that your senior headshots are due from November to November 22nd. The date is pretty close, guys. Yeah. Well, I'm Dread Hannon Jr. I'm Zinedine Beikai. And, and see you guys next time. Now for the SAT word of the day. The word of the day is flagrant. It's an adjective. It means noticeably, noticeably offensive. An example sentence is, the executive was fired for his flagrant abuse of the company express accounts. Synonyms are glaring and outrageous. Thank you.